Hello fellow productivity enhancers! In this video I would like to show you what time range intent type is in Time Planner application version 2.0 and later. But first of all we need to find out what actually intents are in terms of this application, right? So intents are the certain amount of time you're going to spend for certain activity or for the certain task. So now we are looking at the two intents and they have time range type of intents and they are something like events in Google Calendar. They also have start time and end time, but let us create new ones so we can realize what we can do with it. So we press at, at the timeline, we put the more time mark at 1330, then we press plus button where we can see the dialog for the new intent creation, where we can name this intent, we can add it to the top or to the bottom of the intent list, we can pin it to the any activity of this app, let it be meeting, and we can set the start time, let it be 13.30, and end time, let it be 14.40. All right, and uh, it's kind, let it be go, the date, due date, let it be today, and also we can pin task or add reminder for this intent, but it is the topic of another videos. And now we press save button and here we go, we can see the new intent in our schedule. And it's very convenient to adjust your schedule if you have something changed. For instance, you can touch and hold and drag and drop to any new place you need, or you can adjust the start time and end time using those circles when you have your intent highlighted. And also you can use the menu button to operate this object. And it's also very easy to add new intent from the control tab here and from the login tab here. And by the way, as we are in login tab, you can see in goal section the new bubble here. So it's the intent we have just created for today and we can log the time right here. So I wish you have a great time planning and implementing and we will see you in other videos.